Ken Gould Shalom. Shalom. And welcome to Culture Buzz. And welcome to Israel. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here. Ken, you are heading a very special and important uh, organization called Kunst and Israel. Correct. In the Netherlands. Would you be kind enough to tell us more about the organization? What are you doing? What is the purpose? Of course, I'd be happy to. Um, Kunst in Israel exists now for about a year. It's a foundation that is dedicated to promoting and uh, helping support Israeli arts in the Netherlands. Um, so we take the entire spectrum from dance, music, visual arts, to architecture, literature, um, the, 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 the gamut, the complete spectrum, and uh, help it in two ways. One way is with publicity, so everything that's going on in terms of professional arts in the Netherlands, we publicize by means of a, a monthly newsletter in both Dutch and English. A wonderful newsletter, if I may say so myself. Thank you. People are welcome to, to sign up for it. On our website, that's www.kunstenisrael.nl. Highly recommended. Thank you. Uh, a Facebook page, and there's also an interactive agenda, which has a complete overview of everything that's going on in the Netherlands. Besides that, we have uh, a fund, which is uh, meant to, uh, to support arts organizers in the Netherlands that are presenting Israeli art. So we don't give grants directly to Israeli artists or art organizations, but we do uh, provide funding to the decision makers, the stakeholders in the Netherlands that may be considering bringing a, an Israeli artist or an Israeli art project to the Netherlands. What we call motivation, yeah. motivating them. Yeah, absolutely. And, to and show interest in Israeli absolutely. culture. And there are, of course, a number of projects that are already in the planning that uh, when the organizers hear, oh, you have money to, to help make our, our budget possible, they're glad to hear us. But our ultimate goal is to increase the diversity and the, the, the availability of high-quality Israeli arts in the Netherlands. Um, who does not qualify are students, student organizations, uh, study programs, uh, also uh, projects that are in development. Uh, we don't uh, subsidize uh, the, the production of, of art, but the presentation. So basically you are looking for perfectness and maturity. Well, perfectness uh, in the sense of uh, perfectly uh, artistic, uh, perfectly, um, uh, uh, well, not, not perfection. We look for um, uh, a mature artist that uh, will stand the test of, uh, of, of judging by our uh, quality committee. Um, I'm not the one, fortunately, that uh, is the, the one to choose who uh, does and does not get, uh, get funded. Uh, not even when it comes to singing? Not even when it comes to singing. Um, of course, I have my opinions, but ultimately the, the uh, decision is, is, is uh, a more transparent process and uh, is not left to me. And I must say, from what we hear from Poland, though uh, being a relatively a young uh, organization, mm -hmm you are already making uh, quite an impact yeah, on the Netherlands cultural life. Yeah, I feel like we're, we really are existing, uh, have come into existence at the right time, um, partly for unfortunate reasons that, the, the, that um, funding for culture in the Netherlands is being cut. Uh, and Not only in the Netherlands. No, of course, and, and it's very unfortunate, but the result is that we are in a position to uh, help uh, organizations that are in need of funding to, to complete their budgets and to, to make uh, projects possible. And we have this conversation thanks to your visit in uh, Israel. And what is your impression of uh, Israeli culture from what you managed to see? 
Uh, of course, even before I started in this position, I, I was a singer and very familiar with the musical world uh, here in, in, in Israel. Uh, and uh, as director of the Jewish Music Festival in Amsterdam, uh, I also have, have been able to see a lot of world music and klezmer music coming from, uh, from, from Israel. But in the last uh, year and a half, I've, uh, thanks to, to uh, music exposures and, and other events organized by the ministry, but also by uh, just coming every three or four months and diving into the culture here, um, many people have shown me incredible things. And I always go back uh, inspired and, and uh, very thankful that I have this, this role to, to uh, yeah, help, help bring Israeli culture to, to the Netherlands, which is a very uh, art-loving country. Uh, Israel is a, is a country of supply. It's an incredible supply of art and artists and, and creativity and inspiration. And uh, the Netherlands is a land of, of appreciation for arts. So bringing those two things together is very, uh, very natural and very special. And we are very lucky to have you and to have your organization huh? building this bridge. Thank you. Because basically it is a wonderful bridge. Thank you. Well, it's, it's, um, it is unique. Uh, I believe it's the only organization that brings the complete diversity of, of Israeli arts to a single country. Um, and of course we're very happy uh, to, to work, uh, work co closely with the, the, the embassy in, in The Hague. We were also independent. We uh, really want people to understand that we have no political color, we have no religious color. We are, are, are trying to, to show Israel in its complete diversity. Um, and anybody who lives here knows that that diversity is, is extreme and, and beautiful. And uh, um, the, yeah, uh, what, what, man, uh, what one otherwise uh, thinks of with Israel there are many things, but we want to create a connotation of art with Israel, and hence our name, Kunst and Israel, Art and Israel. And it has another meaning, if I'm not wrong. Uh, Kunst and, it can, uh, can also be read as Kunsten, which is the arts. So, Good name. It's a good name. Good name for Thank a very good organization. What can we wish uh, Ken and his organization in the years to come? Um, How high do you set your... Yeah goals? Well, very high. Um, I, th I think we've already succeeded uh, in, in, in bringing some, some great things to, to, to Holland. At the moment, we're not initiating projects ourselves. Uh, we are uh, only assisting organizers and organizations in presenting Israeli culture. Uh, on the long term, we hope to also be presenting things ourselves that, that other organizations might not be able to or interested in presenting. For the moment, that's that's uh, music from the future, and this is definitely music to our ears. I want to thank you very much, Ken, and your organization, and wish you all the best in the highly important work that you are doing. Great, thank you very much. Shalom, shalom.